Hey everyone, this is Jerry, and today I'm going to talk a little bit about my Trek Farley 7, also known as a fat bike. So the first time I rode a fat bike, we were in Michigan. I fell in love with it right away. Went home, kind of started researching fat bikes. I'm a Trek fan, so I went right for the Farley 7. Searched around, we found one about four hours away, so the husband and I packed up the van and took a little road trip. So fat bikes are pretty commonly used in the snow, but there's times I've taken this out in the summertime and rode some rough terrain and the bike goes just fine. So here it is, the Trek Farley 7. Let's get into some details about this bike. So the first thing here is the dropper post. The dropper post on this bike is a Trans XJD YSP 18 dropper post and it has 133 millimeters of dropper travel, which is a fair amount of travel. On top of that, you have a Bond Traeger Arvado saddle, and to control the dropper post, you'll just use this 1X style dropper level. The wheels they come with are a Sun Ringle Mule Foot 80 rim, which is a tubeless ready rim. The rear hub is a Rapid Drive 108 hub, which has 108 points of engagement. The fork is a Mastodon 34 Comp Air Spring Fork that has 80 millimeters of travel. It also has a nice ABS damper with a lockout and has rebound controls. The tire size is 27.5 by 4.5 inches. Now these tires give me a lot of confidence on different terrain, whether I'm riding on snow or loose rocks to roots. The frame on this bike is made from Trek Alpha Platinum Aluminum and the color finish on my bike is called Rorange. I'll admit I wasn't terribly excited about the color at first, but after riding it a couple of times, it did grow on me. The drivetrain runs a SRAM NX Eagle derailleur and it's set up with a PG-1210 rear cassette. Next you have a SRAM dub crankset, which is an X1-1000 Eagle crankset. The brakes are SRAM level T hydraulic brakes and the shifter is a SRAM SX Eagle shifter. Now this bike is about 35 pounds. That's not terribly heavy for me but I do admit I like a lighter bike. So there it is guys, that's an overview of the Trek Farley 7. Thanks for watching this video on the Trek Farley. Leave a thumbs up if you enjoyed the video and don't forget to click subscribe.